So hi everyone, this is Thomas Live, and oh my god, your girl Adele, she's not having it, you know? Donald Trump loves her music, but guess what? She does not want him to play her music on his campaign trail, and I can understand where she's coming from, man. Think about it this way. You got people out there who may support Donald Trump, you know, you guys think very highly of this guy. Adele doesn't want her music to be played at his rallies because then people may get the perception that she supports him. So that's the way this thing works, you know? Like when you hear a certain song, right? With a certain figure. Like let's just say, you know, Hitler was going around like playing a certain song, right? You may start to think like, oh man, yo, Hitler and this artist, they may be cool. Or yo, Hitler listens to this. And that artist will be like, yo, 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 I don't want freaking Hitler playing my stuff because then people are going to think that I'm somewhat connected with this person then the other people who support me and hates this person are not going to listen to my music. So, you know, it could be a business move by Adele, but also, or maybe she doesn't like his views. She may not like his political stance. She's like, hey, I don't want you playing my music at your rallies. So I'm going to tell you guys the songs that he was playing and she totally denied him access to. Now, the name of these songs are Rolling in the Deep and Skyfall. Now, the lyrics of these songs is really what prompt Donald Trump to, you know, play these songs at his rally because now the lyrics that Donald Trump loved about these songs were we could have it all. And when it all crumbles, we stand tall. So I can understand why he wanted to play the music. It sounds like something you would want to tell the nation that you're speaking to, right? You would want them to believe that we could have it all. Also, you would want them to believe that when it crumbles, we will stand tall. You know, it sounds like something that we will actually have as a national anthem here in America. So anyway, I want you guys to let me know in the comment section below. Was Adele wrong for not allowing Trump to play her music at his rallies? This is Thomas Live and I'm out.